So this is the second video on the course of representation theory and after a quick uh, reviewing on the group action we are going to review now uh, for a couple of videos we are going to do uh, we are going to review some concepts of linear algebra that we are going to need for representation theory Okay, let's start with the concept of coordinate vector. <clears throat> if we so we have V, a vector space, and we pick a basis that we usually call it B. Okay. So these are the, the vectors in the base. Okay. And this basis. So the this set has all these vectors b1, b2, etc, bn. So any vector v, so v is in the vector space, any vector v can be written as a linear combination of this, the vectors from the basis multiplied by these scalars. Okay? So v, this vector, in this vector space was written based on this basis, right? With the vectors on this basis. But it was also written with this C1, C2, Cn. Okay? So this C1, C2, Cn, we call this the coordinate vector of V, <clears throat> the coordinate vector of V with respect to the basis B and we write it this way so V <clears throat> is written with the basis B with this basis okay and with all this C1, C2, Cn in the complex to the power of n in from 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 this space. So um, the map T from the vector space V, I'm going to, to do it this way to, to, to distinguish between V vector and V space. So this the map, I'm going to call it T, from the vector space to this space. Uh, given by there yeah, are several ways to to to, to write this. I, I like to write it this way. Okay, so it's given uh, based on the basis B. Okay. So this map from the vector space V to C N given by this T of V such that V is written on the basis of B of B. This is a vector space isomorphism and um, this uh, vector space isomorphism we sometimes call it um, taking coordinates with respect to B. This is very important. Okay, so in a certain way we are writing the vector based on the on the basis B, right? So that's why we call it taking coordinates with respect to B. So this this vector V is written based upon this basis. Okay? That's why this is the definition of coordinate vector. <clears throat>